Hello everybody and welcome to our phase five phonics. Right, we'll start with our phase five sounds. Off we go. Four. You. Ow. Ew. Uh. Oh. You. W. A. A. Oi. I. O. I. O. E. E. Super. Okay. Let's go on to our tricky word trucks. Off we go. Oh, could, asked, would, should, looked, Mrs. called, Mr. there, people, super, okay. Let's introduce our sound for today. We'll start with just looking at some more information about our split diagram. And cute. So here we have. So when the diagrams A, E, 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 I, E, and O, E, and U, E are separated by a consonant, they become split diagrams. The A and E separated by the consonant K and in the other words, they are separated in these, separated by the S, in bite, by the T, in whole, with the consonant L separating O and E, and in cute, the consonant T. Words with split digraphs make a long vowel sound. So in these words, A, E, I, O, U. Which letters are... Okay, so they make the long vowel sounds. A, E, I, O, U. Okay, let me show you what the split diagraph we're doing today is. It's O, E. So I'm just going to show you this video. Coal, the mole dug a hole through the globe, then slept on a rosebed in his very deep home. He woke from his doze, poked out his nose, his bones froze to stone in the icy south pole. Guitar! Coal, the mole dug a hole through the globe, then slept on a rose bed in his very deep home. He woke from his doze, poked out his nose, his bones froze to stone in the icy south pole. Okay, so we're doing the OE, and as you can see, that song has lots of of OE split diagraph sounds. Okay, so now I've introduced the sound, let's have a look at how to write the sound. Okay, off we go. So we've got the O here. It'll make the O sound as well. So we go around, down to the line, back up again. And then for E, we go across, up, and back around, down to the line, and we've finished. So these are both short letters. They're not tall. They don't reach underground. They just stay in the grass, okay? They're short. So one more time, starting here, do our coat hanger C. We go around. Back up to join. And then for our E, we go across, up, around, and then to the line. And we should end on the line. OK, let's have a look at what we've got here. So here's a picture of a flower. This specific flower is called a rose. So it's O, O, 
Now, if I left it there, it would say ross, ross, because it would still be the short vowel, but we want the long vowel, so we're going to put our E on the end. Rose, rose, super. And then this one is a picture of a bone, bone. So we need to be doing B, O, N. So if I left it like that, it would be B, O, N, Bon, the short vowel, but I want to add my E to make the word bone. Okay, super. Now we've done that, let's look at some words. Make it bigger so you can see better. Right, let's have a read. Oat, boat, real or fake? Fake. Z oak, zoke, real or fake? Fake. B own, bone, real or fake? We've just seen that, haven't we? A bone, it's part of your body, a body part. Note, note, real or fake? It's real. If you write, if it's a note, it's a small bit of writing that you normally write to somebody else. Ding, ding. X, k, g, l, o, d. Explode, explode. Real or fake? Fake. <laughs> home, home. Real or fake? It's real. A home is somewhere that you live. Ding, ding. <laughs> alone, alone. Real or fake? It's real. If you're alone, it means nobody else is with you. W oak, woke. Real or fake? It's real, as in I woke up this morning. It means I got up. It means I stopped sleeping and I was awake. Ding, ding. J o Joel. Real or fake? Fake. Shows. Shows. Real or fake? It's fake. Okay, well done. 10 out of 10. Last activity of our, our phase five phonics our sentences. Okay, off we go. Can a st own stone exp load explode? Can a stone explode? I think it definitely could explode if there was something that was strong enough to make it explode. Even if you hit it with a hammer, it would probably explode into lots of tiny pieces. Okay, oh, this is a long sentence. If you are home, home, alone, alone, and you find a bone, bone, will you get on the phone, phone? If you are home, alone, and you find a bone, will you get on the phone? Okay, so if you were home and nobody else is there, would you find it strange if you found a bone and then ring somebody and say, I found a bone in my home. <laughs> okay, you might do, it depends. It might be a bone that should be there. We don't know. It might be a bone from your dinner. Okay, last one. Will you see a queen on a throne or a throne or on an Envelope. Envelope. Will you see a throne? A queen on a throne. So that's a royal chair. Or on an envelope, something that you send letters in. Hmm. 
I think that she'd be on the throne, wouldn't she, where the royal people all sit and it's very fancy. She she might accidentally sit on an envelope, but I don't think she would do it on purpose. Okay, thank you for joining me today. I'm so glad that you're doing amazing learning. Have a great day. Goodbye.